But I can't guarantee that that's going to happen because this is Big Brother, and who knows what's going to do, what's going to happen between those two seconds of coming off a block and going back into like a house meeting. It didn't happen beforehand, and unless I see it, did you tell him that he needed to do it before? That's not my. That's not I'm, my. I'm not saying. I just asked you a question. No, I didn't know you wanted to have a house meeting beforehand. That wasn't discussed with me. Okay. It's not. It's also not my responsibility to iron out the logistics of how this is going to go. I just go. asked the question. Okay. So, again, I'm not Bailey. I can't speak for Bailey. I know. I That's just wanted to make sure that she was kind of okay and, you know, like I can understand her being upset and, like, the situation is, you know, frustrated with the situation. But I can't explain to her how to separate personal and game. And regardless of whatever Tyler decided to do, regardless of whatever you guys decided to do, certain steps weren't taken in order to ensure that happened. And honestly, like, well, that's what you have to understand. You have but to. But it's un- not my decision. But you, it's but not you, my responsibility to send him home. And that's fine. But what you also have to understand is now we've had all these conversations and you've cried and told her I want you to be here and I want you to do this and I want you to do that and then you had the opportunity to keep her here and you chose not to but I know that no matter what has happened between us that she will hold that against me how do you know that though and whatever has happened him coming to her between like them having an issue how do you know hold that against you I, I can't take my chances but how do you know? Because I I have to take my intuition. But see, this is this because is, this, this situation is, with her not having with her having an attitude with me right now confirms it. No, no, no. It's you telling me that. that you had to keep her back and from from being angry with me all week confirms it. You I told you what that you had to like not convince her not to be mad at me. Yeah, because you nominated us. Yeah, because she told me information that she shouldn't have had. Okay, well, I don't like, you don't ask somebody it's untouchable. I don't feel like you can even use if that. you're like in a foursome or whatever. Christmas, I don't you don't think... tell anybody that you're that that person's you're untouchable. Christmas, I don't think you can use that as leverage because you were somebody who, from what I understand, that you is went to leverage. her. From what I understand, you were somebody who went to her and was like, "Hey." No one in this house talks to him with me, and I feel like I'm out of the loop. I know you said that to me as well. Okay. You are and, misinformed. And anytime, anytime her and I talked game, she came to me. And that night specifically, she sat on my bed mm-hmm. and asked me who my untouchable was. Mm-hmm. I said I didn't have one, and she said you were hers. Mm-hmm. So I'm not pulling information out from her. Mm-hmm. I am not a victim in this house needing help. So with that being said... <clears throat> I'm sorry, I'm getting heated. I'm you sorry. are. That's not. You that's really not are. from you. I'm you, sorry, and I, I know because I'm me, not Bailey. I just want to turn it down a little bit. Mm-hmm. I feel like the conversations you had with her and how you guys would talk about game and how you guys would do this and would do that. She felt like I said, you and me were on equal ground to her. We were on equal ground to her, and so you pulling the trigger on her was almost like me pulling the trigger on her. That's all I'm saying to you. That is why her feelings are hurt. That's why she feels betrayed. Because it's almost like I won HOH and I threw her on the block. That's how she feels. I And and honestly, the reason I don't feel betrayed by you is because I didn't have that connection with you. I didn't sit up and talk to you for hours. I didn't sit up and talk to you throughout this, 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 and this. I didn't have that bond with you. We came in the house together, and I told you what I told you about our room, and I meant that, and that was solid to me. So when I was shot, I was a little taken aback, but I didn't feel the level of betrayal that you, that she did, because that was y'all thing. You get what I'm saying? I do. That's where she is. She feels heavily betrayed by you. Heavily betrayed. Never once has she said, I would like to work with you. Not once. Mm Mm-hmm. And there's, everybody knows that you can have casual game talk with somebody. Mm -hmm. The only time that we talked game was when we had to because we had intersections dodging Janelle. 